Welcome back to my Let's Play for Blood Ties. And I suppose it's time to continue our journey deep into the depths of this dungeon. After all, we do have to go looking for um, Gendel's former apprentice here in order to get some answers. Maybe she knows of a secret weak spot. Eh, at least we can hope, right? Because without one of those, it's going to be really hard to kill this guy. At least I imagine so, but I guess we'll... Hope for the best, and no my luck will be told he has no weaknesses whatsoever. And that we're royally screwed. Oh well, is it the fire way back from it? Hey, darn, am I feeling tired right now? I spent most of yesterday sleeping, so that might be part of it. And I sorta of wish I had bought some Mountain Dew while I was at Walmart earlier. Instead, I got a bunch of Fanta and stuff. I do have some Mountain Lightning, but you know, knockoff Mountain Dew isn't always a replacement for the real thing. <sighs> man, I guess we're dancing there. I guess they're like, man, we don't want to die! I'm like, nope, you got to. You got to die for me. Because I need some extra experience. I want to reach a higher level, after all. Oh jeez. I just forgot to kill in these rooms that all look the same. I'm sure there's subtle differences, but for the most part they look identical. Like seriously, just repeating the same map over and over again does not make for an interesting dungeon. It makes for a really boring one. Try and change the pace up a little bit, you know? Something. Yeah, like that. At least it's different from the last, like, three rooms, you know? <sighs> I'll take whatever victories I can get. Ooh, a prisoner. I don't know if she's the prisoner we're looking for. Uh, whatever. We should just have to go exploring and see if we can find someone that's actually willing to talk to us. And if nothing else, we'll find some items at least, right? Ooh, another prisoner. How many people are imprisoned here? Why are they imprisoned here? Seriously, who runs this place? Is this Gendel's, um, own prison? And you think he'd have more guards trying to stop me then? Or they give up on defending this place, you know, super harshly, because they're like, you know, that'd be pointless. Ah, uh, go away. Because you won, so I don't need to do it again. I guess in this case I do, because, you know, fast enough to catch me, but still. And great, now I learned another spell. Which means I have to go searching even harder to find the next the skill I actually want to use. Darn it. Guess I shouldn't care about it too much, but it's mildly annoying, what can I say? Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if our target's just straight ahead and this is just meant to be a distraction. Oh well, at least we can look for some rare items, hopefully. Stupid yawn. Necromancer ring, eh? Ring to help us summon the dead. Huh. Oh, gotcha. Sounds sweet. Sure, we gotta give up our um, ability to cast statics. Not status, um, our power there a little bit. But I'm willing to sacrifice some power for a useful item like that. Something that blocks status effects can just not be ignored. Hopefully we'll find a few more, actually. Because I'd love to be able to, you know, block that in case any of the bosses coming up can use it. <sighs> but yeah, just a few items. Though one of them was definitely worth the pickup. Ah, get off my tail, man. <sighs> Crap, we gotta kill this thing for a third time? Don't you guys ever give up? Now what I have to do after I get done with this episode, I need to go refill my cup with ice. 
and put some soda in it. And we're back to basically the semi room stuff. Only some mild differences. Come on, be a bit more creative than that. Ugh. This game has some of the most boring dungeon designs I've ever seen in an RPG Maker game, and I've played a lot. <sighs> and when I'm calling you out on it, you know it's bad. Tia Matt Ring, eh? Hmm. Well, no. Um, let's go with that. Let's see. You getting that. And after that, we can just get back to trying to get away. <sighs> I'm honestly starting to get bored with these guys. <sighs> they can't fight for crap. And they're only slowing me down at this point. Sure, they drop potions, but what I want are spirit bottles. Or more powerful um, SP restoratives. Instead of the junk they keep giving me. <sighs> of course there has to be more of this place. It never ends, right? I'm surprised we actually dodged that one. Ah, darn it. Now I feel obligated to kill it just to waste a little magic. Oh, we'll also use a more powerful skill just because we can. I mean, the healing point's right there, so it's not like I can't instantly recover here. <sighs> this probably means there's a boss in here. Are you Ellis? Maybe. Who's asking? The ones that came to rescue you. We don't give a crap about anyone else, though. Oh, then yes, I'm Ellis. Alright, then let's get you out of there. It's not that I don't believe in your pure and good hearts, but what do you want in exchange? Well, we do need a favor. Of course you do, otherwise you wouldn't have come to rescue me. Well, what was that? It's that same presence. You're becoming quite an inconvenience to me. I'm tired of you getting in my way. Gendel? You'll not live another day if I have my say. What, you sent a generic knight after me? Why do they send the most useless of people after me? Like, seriously, you can't come up with anything better. Oh, we might have to give that blocker to her so she can use the spell plus on him. Okay. Um... Let's see, stunning blow, yep. Oh, let's get focused. After all, we do have to rely on our powerful magic to end this, right? And he's locked down and can't fight back. Oh, sucks to be you. Oh my gosh. We actually learned a more powerful magic attack finally. I'm honestly surprised. Um, Tornado Axe. Yeah. That ought to take care of him. Of course, you know, the fire magic still does the most work here, doesn't it? Do not mess with clothes. She will burn you alive. Um, let's see, that's not what I'm looking for. Guess we'll go with this. Darn, I was hoping he had a high damage attack, but not yet, apparently. I can't imagine this will last very long, yeah. Okay. What the heck? Does he see everything? <sighs> Looks that way. He became even more powerful. Yes, he has the clear crystal now. Which they misspelled in an earlier scene where they had I instead of Y, but whatever. 
Hmm, so the rumors were true. Listen, we don't have much time here. Helen said you'd know how to defeat him, so please tell us. Well, I don't know if it'll be enough to defeat him anymore, but your best shot is with the Shining Ray. I have never even heard of it. Of course not. I created it myself, and he never told anyone except Ken and never told anyone except Kendall back when he was my master. How exactly can we use it? Create so it block any power accessory, which means that I can use it against Gendel. He won't be able to put on the clear crystal, but the effect is temporary. Sounds promising, but where can we find it? Yet yeah, Gendel's spying on us, so he knows where you hit it now. Thanks. Very well, then. We'll drop you at. <laughs> head back to the swamp. Yeah, yeah. Seriously, don't thank her. She's not worth it. Okay. There. That way you know she can heal everyone else. Jeez. <sighs> I know, I know, this is only a minor inconvenience at best, because we're just going to keep wiping them all out and then get to safety anyway, you know? I'm almost inclined not to show this, just because it doesn't really add anything to the story, because I doubt we're going to run anything on the way out. <sighs> but maybe the game will surprise me for a change. I have my doubts, but I can always have my hopes up. They might actually expand on something. And yeah, I'm so tired of these enemies, I'm not even willing to really fight them unless I have to. So it's time to do some dances of dodging here, or at least try to. I won't go all out on that though. After all, they are easy to kill, so what'd be the point? Sometimes dodging is just too much work with enemies this week. Damn, it popped up right in front of me. <sighs> at least we know we're at about the halfway point, right? Damn. I have the worst luck. I'm like, I'm doing good, I'm doing fine, and then BAM, they turn right towards me. I'm like, I can walk in a straight line faster than them, right? And they're like, no. <sighs> Jeez. Got lucky twice there. I'm honestly surprised. Oh, well, took a wrong turn, Albuquerque there. <laughs> well, we're victorious. Ooh. Almost got me there, but you failed. <sighs> Good. Now we can head back to the village. And, you know, look for um, new stuff, which there isn't going to be any, but we can always buy new items, I hope. Um, or at least, you know, restock our supplies of spirit bottles. And now we're broke again, but whatever. Now I go look for the entrance to that swamp set. Hmm. No. Am I gonna have to go back to this pass to get to the swamp? Yeah. Well, I'll do that in my own time, because I doubt there's gonna be anything in here either. Jeez, I hate backtracking in games like this. Till next time, then. See ya.